Hello, guys from OpenGate, everything's fine with you. With us, everything's okay. We're doing a follow up on an animal here today. Renato came here today to take a look at this animal. And, you know, as soon as we arrived, we found that the animal. Well, Renato, can you please hold him so we can show to the guys what is happening? So, guys, um, you can see that the animal it is with. Oh, you see, guys, the professional can handle it. And the animal has a lot of bugs in his ear, you know? And what was recommended, in fact, what we recommended was that, well, we needed to start an action to put an end to this animal's worm, both because of the suffering and because the worms, because they eat the nerve of the ear and the ear falls off. You can see that, guys, that is already very ugly and also because of the quality of life of the animal after all he's suffering a lot calm down dear calm down hey calm down calm down hey well <laughs> you, you, see, you can see guys that it's a little agitated because you know there's a lot of stuff in, in her ear it's quite inflamed and the owner here gave her some medication you can see that we still have some bugs inside and what we have to do well we are going to wash and sanitize and then go inside uh, with a product and also with a vitamin you know to help and this vitamin will help us and here in question we are going to make the animal change its hair and grow a more beautiful one and also strengthen the hoof which is what the vitamin is going to do in this animal so uh, we have already carried out some tasks at open gate and we have had excellent results and it will also fortify the animal's heart and airways making breathing easier you know is smoother a smoother heartbeat and well at first we want that hair to fall and a hair to grow new and the vitamin will help a lot to lift this animal, allowing it to become much prettier. Guys, and well, and the inside of the animal is also much fortified. Now we are going to look for a place to be able to do this washing. And we are going to show you the whole process. And we are going to remove all the worms that are here. The possible worms that were here. Uh, she is very skittish. Guys, calm down, girl, calm down. So, guys, it's quite inflamed. We are going to treat this animal. Guys, we have already done the part of the procedure, we put her on the floor and we always say that, guys, we need to control the head of the animal to not let, you know, kick the head over the ground because this is a sensitive part of the equine, so we need to control it with the head. So we have already stabilized it and she is collaborating a lot with treatment because she's a tame animal and very easy to deal with. Even given the situation that she is in, go there, Renato. You can see, guys, it's really quite inflamed. There's a lot of pain. So, we will start it, doing a cleaning here, and remove the excess of inflammation. And we are going to do the injectable and inflammatory part in the animal. Calm down, just a little more, calm down. It is for your own good. Okay. 
também. Só que daí o que acontece? O pessoal gosta de raspar. People like to shave it a lot because many times there are ticks. You see, and ticks get more in the ear. I said so he could prune a little in there. Oh yes, for sure, but you know, after we do all of this, but in the field, daily, this is hard to control. Now let's put the medicine there now. The animals will certainly to get up. Oh my gosh. <laughs> she threw me away, guys, but nobody got hurt. The animal threw everyone away. Let's go. Come on up. <laughs> Very well, guys, we finished it here. We already put the medicine and, you know, it was also done the treatment and it was instructed the honor to use the silver medicine twice a day, morning and afternoon to not allow uh, to have worms again. And if if you look, we did a good one cleaning outside and also inside and also with the medicine applied, the inflammatory was applied and the pain was subsided. She allows us to put our hand on her ear. You can see that she's even calmer now because she was in pain and wouldn't let us. Guys, I hope you enjoyed it, everyone stay with God, until next time, God willing. Our motto is to listen to those who have no voice to be heard.